Yo, what's good, y'all? This is your boy Checko G, aka El Buca17. Yo, I just wanted to make a quick video on this uh, prominence poker uh, game and and the prominence poker community, of course, or the poker community itself that uh, that lives within the confinements of the PlayStation 4. Um, there's not many uh, there's not many poker games for the PlayStation 4. There's one called uh, Pure Hold'em, which is okay in my book i mean i'm not a fan of it in my opinion i believe that prominence poker is by far the best uh poker game you know on the playstation 4 by far uh you know there's a lot of reasons i i can get into uh for why uh you know this game is probably the best poker game currently on the playstation 4 uh one of them is uh, because it's fucking free, so that's a pretty damn good fucking reason for this game to be fr uh, probably the best poker game on the PlayStation 4. But other than that, though, you know, I really do enjoy this game. I really do uh, recommend any poker player who enjoys poker and doesn't know what poker game to go with on the PS4. I recommend this game. Um, I do believe that. They need to make a lot of improvements on this game. Um, I, I feel like uh, one of the improvements that they should have is when you're doing tournaments, they should at least show where you're ranked in, on the leaderboards. Like, they should actually put that on your, like, little, uh, you know, username or whatnot or your little emblem thing. You know, they should at least do that. Um, they do have a lot of cool features to this game that don't exist in other games currently on the PlayStation 4, which is why I enjoy this game. Um, but like I was saying, though, I do believe that there needs to be a lot more improvements to this game. Um, definitely, there needs to be more DLCs, I feel. There needs to be more tables. I, I, right now, I believe there's only like five to four. Uh, I believe it's five tables. There was four DLCs, uh, and each one came with a, a different table plus the original table that w that already existed in the game. Uh, I do like all the settings that they have in this game, but I feel like th there needs to be more. There needs to be more tables in the game. There needs to be probably I don't I don't know about uh, different types of hold'em. I, I don't really care about Omaha or none of the other other poker branches that they have. Five card draw is decent. They should probably have the original one in the game as well. Like five card draw and Texas Hold'em. Boom. That's it. And then you could get ranked in, in either or. But other than that, I feel like if if they could at least add like maybe like tournaments that have like 100 players in them. Or maybe, I don't know, tournaments up to 50 maybe sounds pretty cool. You know, like as, you know, like there used to be a um, a poker game on the 360 that I used to play a lot where um, it was like uh, a game that actually was uh, produced by Microsoft. And you can actually take in your little avatar in there and play poker and stuff. It was pretty awesome. But I did, I do, I did like the fact that they had these uh, tournaments that were pretty huge, and a, as people were getting knocked out, you know, you were be, you were getting uh, sent to different tables, and you know, other, you know, other tables with other with uh, more more people. Um, on this game, the highest limit to each table is six, which I, you know, I like the six thing, but I feel like they need to add more people. They need to they need to have at least ten player tables. At least that would be awesome and uh, you know I may be wrong about the the tables but I'm pretty sure that it's six I may be wrong but I'm pretty damn sure that it's six but either way though I feel like there should be like at when we're doing these tournaments I feel like they should have like up to a 20 uh, limit table or if as you progress they should at least Put like 50 player tables or 100 t uh, player tables as you keep going higher up the ladder. I feel like that would be pretty freaking awesome. But I mean, there's still a lot of improvements that I could talk about in this game. Um, but 
you know, I don't know if that's going to happen or not. But what I would really like to see is something like WSOP bringing in a game to the PS4 or something, something that's ranked, something that's really nice looking that gives you an opportunity to build your own avatar like this game. I feel like this game did it right by letting you, allowing you to create an avatar. Uh, I don't know. It just, it just makes me feel like, like I'm in the game somehow. Like I created my own character. This is my own, you know, my own attitude towards the, towards the game. This is, this is what I would like to feel on a table right there. You know, I, I don't really go dressed up like this and shit to a table, but you know, if I could, I would, you know, I would do it. Maybe not with the, the 80s or uh, 70s fucking uh, suit over there, but maybe a little, you know, formal, formally dressed or whatever. I mean, it really doesn't matter. But I do like the fact that it allows you to bring in your character into the game. So that's something that I feel like should be a must in every other poker game that comes out now. Now, this game is almost a rant in a way and almost a uh, a plead to bring in more poker games. Because there is a big poker fan base, a, a really huge poker fan base. And I feel like, you know, video game a company should capitalize on that. Like, WSOP should definitely capitalize on it. Maybe they didn't do so well in the past. But I don't know. I just feel like right now in these times we we can go for a poker game, you know. And and something that looks you know high quality graphics, not too cartoony. This looks a little toony here, which is you know it, it's okay for me because it doesn't look as cartoony as the one that I used to play with uh, uh, play on and and the, the 360. That one was a little different. It was a little more cartoonyish. So you know. You can say that it was, it, it seemed like it was more kid based. Although you can't say that a po the poker games or poker in general is very kid based, because I I don't, you know, I just don't picture a lot of kids playing this game. But definitely a lot of adults will play this game. And uh, you know, big shout out to Index, man. Big shout outs to uh, Hasus. Shout outs to EV. Shout outs to Fonzo. So I was J verse all, all, all my homies, you know, back in the day we used to play poker and, you know, uh, big shout outs to them. They got me, they kind of got me, got the ball rolling and got me all into this poker game and not this uh, poker game uh, specifically, but uh, poker in general. Like I, I, I do play poker tournaments in real life and stuff like that. And I enjoy it. I love it. I, I fucking love it. I used to go to the casino, um, uh, you know, of course, here in Texas, it's not legal, so I have to go cross a border to uh, actually play. Uh, but I I love it, and and I'm willing to go do that. I mean, it's a good way to make money if you need money. And I feel like they should be teaching this shit in school. Like, that's just my opinion, but I feel like they should. But either way, though... Um, I really do believe that other companies should be getting into this poker game. And if anybody, you know, sh bring in sponsors, whatever, I'm down to play for sponsors. Hey, whatever. I, I don't care. I just feel like this game, poker, Texas Hold'em to be specific, is something that video game companies could capitalize on. It's just there needs to be someone who's willing to do it. I mean, I would if I could. If I had the means to start my own, I would. If I could invest in something, you know, bring it, bring it in. You know, comment down below what you think. You guys out there who watch my channel, let me know what you think about this. You know, how you uh, see poker in general. What you think of it. Would you see more of it? Would you play a game? You know, let me know. Anybody out there, anybody watching this, let me know what you think about uh, the idea of having more po poker games. You know, we, right now we only have two, and I believe there's one that's like uh, casino styled. So there's like different stuff in there, which would be nice too. 
having like a casino style game where you can play multiple types of games in there. But for me, I'm a big fan of Texas Hold'em, so I want a Hold'em game. That's what I want. You know, if they if they can add side games in there like blackjack, uh, rush or the roulette or whatever, if they can add those, that's cool. But for me, it's Texas Hold'em, and uh, I want to see a new I want to see a new game. But other than that, that's pretty much it. You know, th those were just my thoughts on uh, on uh, the poker scene and how I feel. You know, somebody should expand on it. Um, like I said, I would if I could, but you know, I don't have the means to do so. If I could, I would. And uh, who knows if, if I get enough comments below, shit, I'll, I'll start a fund and I'll try to, you know, see if, if people will help me fund it, the project and I'll, I'll do it myself. Fuck it. But other than that though, I do appreciate everybody who's, uh, been watching the channel uh, liking, disliking, whatever, commenting. I appreciate every single one of you guys. The channel is growing uh, a little more, you know, more and more, little by little. But it's it's growing, and you know, patience is a virtue. So you know, you, I, I'm I'm having as much patience as I, as I can, and and I'm gonna continue because there's nothing more I can do. But uh, besides, you know keep making videos so with that said right there that's that for me big shout outs to everybody like i mentioned earlier uh shout outs to all the uh people in the destiny destiny community shout outs to all my people in the fifa community shout outs to all my people all over the place in all the gaming scenes that you could think of you know we're all gamers shout outs but that's that for me and I am out, and I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.